Hello, everyone. In this episode of Doing Business in Ghana, we will be talking about real estate. In fact, the real estate business or the sector is booming in, in Ghana, and a lot of people are trying to venture into that sector because it's very promising, it's sustainable, and once you follow the rules in this sector, you're likely to gain a lot of profit from your investment. Before we start, kindly remember to subscribe and share so that a lot of people can see this video. First of all, somebody would ask what real estate is all about. You know, some would go into real estate for commercial purposes, some for residential purposes, some, you know, um, would build for industrial purposes. Um, And then others would just go into buying and selling of lands. Whichever way it is, there is good money and there's good profit if you do it the right way. Why am I saying if you do it the right way? You know, before you get into real estate, you, you first need your land. And in most parts in Africa, the um, lands have got, you know, a few issues. So you make sure you stay away from lands that are having litigation problems here and there, you know, and all those you know issues surrounding it. Before you buy the land, you check with the land commission and see if it is safe to buy. Once you are through with that, you can make your payments and then you start developing your property. Our, 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 <coughs> our agency is there to help you decide on the best um, decisions to make concerning um, real estate because you know we, we, we have stated into this for a long time um, we know which sectors are doing very well especially with real estate um, and in the cities those who are building for residential and commercial purposes are getting a lot of profit from their investment most of the old houses that are by the roadside, you know, have more or less been converted into commercial properties. Because once a lot of people are moving in into the cities and the city is getting overpopulated, there is a need for people to work. There is a need for people to get um, offices, um, you know, and other um, um, commercial um, activities to go on in the city. So um, most of the buildings in the cities um, have either been converted into commercial um, properties or new ones have been erected to serve the needs of um, the people. Some are going in, um, into uh, the building of um, supermarkets, uh, malls, uh, and you know none of these people are um, have re- re- regretted you know going into this kind of business. Because once you start building them, you already even get um, the occupants, <laughs> one way or the other. You know, people come in uh, to give you down payments in some areas, especially if it's a very busy area. You know, you get all the support you need to, to put up the structure. And once it is done, no vacancy will be left. Everything will be occupied. So those going into commercial properties um, in the cities are are doing very well and um, there are some who are also building affordable housing units in their cities because um, you know it is a wish of every worker or everybody to own their own um, house (coughs) they want to be their own landlords and um, get away from no renting but uh, the, the the cost of living sometimes and then the, the cost of these um, housing units that are put up by private estate developers are somehow uh, on the high side and not everybody can afford it. Uh, most of the buildings are luxurious buildings, you know, and only the rich can afford it. So investors who want to uh, make quick returns, you know, quick um, um, profits from the real estate, uh, business in Ghana, I uh, usually advise them to 
uh, put up low cost housing units or affordable housing units where you can get like um, one bedroom um, apartments or one bedroom houses um, two to three bedroom houses or four bedroom at the most um, could be detached or semi-detached sometimes you know it could be on a vast area of land you have several units of um, two bedroom houses three bedroom houses detached or semi-detached with children's playground uh, with a business center with internet accessibility a, a parking lot a car um, uh, terminal whatever um, a community library you know tennis court you know things like this um, um, it attracts um, a lot of people to pay attention to such um, an estate project um, I know a couple of estate developers who you know have used this plan and you know this is the right way to to make it um, so quickly in this kind of business most of these estate developers are able to sell the houses they've built you know um, um, twice or three times the original cost price so I mean you should know nobody should tell you that this is a good business and it's um, there's no 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 um, uh, you know you should understand why a lot of people are going into it uh, there are still a lot of land available um, at very good places um, which have no litigation issues so if you are interested in acquiring you know any property uh, in Ghana for real estate purposes you can contact us um, we have people that we work with you know who can help get a right uh, thing done and then you know you get your your, your retains um, quickly um, with most of these um, estate projects um, if you whether you are building from to rent them out or you're building for sale um, you're sure that you know within um, two to five years you know you're able to get your um, your money back with say double or triple um, profits so the, the the return on investment is high in this kind of business but as usual you, know, you always have to pass through the right people the right agencies and this is why we are here you know to help guide you through registration processes you know um, in, in, in everything that you need to do all the permits that you need to acquire so that you know you don't get stuck along the line my videos are mainly um, done for foreign investors who really want to come to Ghana to um, do business so this is about real estate but there is a more um, there is more to discuss um, in terms of real estate which you know um, not all can be said in this video so if you are interested as a foreigner and want to know more please write to us or send us a whatsapp message with all your questions and um, we will answer them for you uh, you can find our email address